right? If you're not aware, this was a massive outage in IT systems uh, in the last few hours worldwide. They're saying it's the biggest IT outage uh, ever, you know. Uh, very quickly, a company called CrowdStrike were doing an upgrade to the Microsoft systems and there was a massive problem uh, with the software and it's kind of crashed a lot of stuff. Now the problem is uh, most companies, it seems to be the vast majority of companies seem to be using Microsoft, you know. So it's calling massive uh, issues worldwide. Now it's not just travel, it's places, hospitals, pharmacies, uh, even read right there uh, just a few minutes ago that like Ladbrokes, the bookies are having problems. So look, because I'm based here in the Canary Islands, I'm just going to focus on travel very quickly. Um, the big airlines in the States like uh, American Airways and United Airlines have grounded their fleets. Uh, so it's going to be a massive case over there today. Uh, just heard that KLM are doing the same. Uh, if you're traveling today, get on Sky News or BBC or whatever, because the reports are coming in very quickly, you know. Um, for example, in Gatwick Airport, barcodes are not working, so they're actually having to check people through uh, security manually. So you can imagine the disruption that's going on at airports. Uh, I just heard a radio show there where someone rang in saying that they couldn't access their Ryanair boarding pass on the app. So um, it's not just uh, tra it's train stations as well. Uh, listening to BBC there, there seems to be problems at Dover very port as well so it's just I'm just trying to give you a general view it's going to be chaos today um, now what they're saying is like with airlines is like to call your airline uh, try and get information maybe online if you can but just saying call your airline um, if you're going to travel either from the Canary Islands or to the Canary Islands no I don't think that's going to be as easy as it sounds like call your airline everyone's going to be calling their airline and they're having problems with their systems uh it'll probably will affect uh, your hotel check-in as well but like say if you're coming here and you're already here i just think it's going to be delay uh hotels will just have to check in people uh in some kind of manual process um but i would say i'd count yourself lucky if it got here before this has happened like today you might just have to wait a lot longer to check in so um, my advice um, is like if you're traveling to the Canaries uh, in the next couple of days or traveling home, uh, start watching the news. Um, you'll get more information there because it's been updated like every minute.